And all right, guys, welcome back to another video on the David Hammond YouTube channel. Now, in this one, guys, we are speaking of NoFap, another NoFap video. And this one, guys, is why NoFap is not the only answer, okay? I believe I titled it that. And the reason what I mean by this, guys, is I probably receive, no word of a lie, maybe, I'm gonna say, man, like, close to 100 DMs a day, okay? 50 to 60 DMs a day, and a lot of them, not all of them, but they either revolve around woman or NoFap, and a big... And I mean, essentially, those two are related. It's why you guys start NoFap. NoFap is not the only answer, okay? And now, what do I mean by this? A lot of times when I get these DMs about NoFap, it's like, hey, David, I've been doing this, but, you know, I'm relapsing, or it's it's too difficult, or it's too hard, or I'm confused, and can you help me? Can you help me? Can you help me? Which makes sense. You know, I love helping you guys. But what's, what you must understand, because 99% of the times when I send this reply back, I literally should copy and paste this reply and just smack it. I say to you guys, I literally send you voice memos because it just I've said it so many times. NoFap is not the only way. NoFap is not the only answer. And what I mean by that is when you are beginning to let go of an old habit, let's say you were fapping, right? So you're letting go of an old habit. You must, okay? So NoFap, you're letting go of an old habit. You must now introduce other habits into your life. You have to. NoFap and other habits go hand in hand. I truly believe that you can't no one who's done it long term, no one just does no fat for no fat. No one. That that literally doesn't make sense. That's like buying gasoline for no car. It just doesn't make sense. Like you can buy gasoline and just carry it, but that's almost frivolous. Like you could do no fap just for no fap, but it just it wouldn't make sense. I don't think you would stick long enough with it. You would relapse. You would fail. You have to divert this energy into other areas, other passions, other hobbies. So what I say to you guys is do things like intermittent fasting, maybe meal prep, right? Cook, clean, um, read books, meditate, do yoga. I don't know, early rising, go for runs, jog, sprint, home workouts. It's like you have to, you have, you have to do other things. Find creative endeavors, passions, businesses. NoFap is linked to all of them because you must understand is, guys, like you were literally giving up a habit. You can't, you can't, it's very hard to just give up a habit and now have this void because what are you going to do with this void? You're going to fill it back up with a habit and you'll most likely go back to that old habit because it's, it's familiar. Right? It's like alcohol, it's like alcohol or, or, or cigarettes, right? Why do you guys think they have things called, uh, what are they called? Nic Nicorettes, right? The little gum. Okay. So when you stop smoking cigarettes, you have to literally, especially in the beginning, you have to replace it with other things. You can't just, you know, you can't just have that void there. So maybe you're, you know, you stop smoking and you, uh, I don't know, you go for a walk or you start working out or you start reading or you start taking that little Nicorette gum. You have to replace the habit. If you guys have read uh, Power of Habit by Charles Duhigg, I believe that's what it was years ago. Um, you have to replace your habit. Now, I don't say this because I read a book and like yada yada. It's like, I've experienced this. You have to replace shit. Otherwise, you will go back to old ways. You will, dude. It's just, it's human nature. When you have boredom and all this free time on you and you're not doing things, dude, you're gonna, you're gonna revert to what's easiest. You just will, right? It's like looking at like five pieces of food, you know? For the most part, and this is why fast food is so dangerous, whatever's fastest, cheapest, and easiest, we're just gonna grab. Unless we make the conscious effort to replace it with something, you know, more wholesome, dude, it's cheap and it's fast. We're just gonna, we're gonna grab it. So, what I'm saying to you guys is NoFap is not the only answer, voice crack. So what I'm saying to you guys is NoFap is not the only answer. It is one tool and tactic which should be accompanied by many other things. Now, I'm not saying you have to fast or you have to do these cold showers and early rise. I'm not saying any of that. What do you naturally want to do? What are you already doing? Are you an athlete? Do you like playing soccer? Do you have creative passions? A lot of you guys that I have clients, you guys have these side hustles and, and side businesses and you're starting YouTube channels and you literally have started them because of NoFap. That is amazing. You need other endeavors, okay? Creative endeavors is one of the best things I can say to you guys because you must understand that sexual energy essentially is creative energy. It's masculinity. It's just, it's test. It's just, it wants to it wants to produce. It wants to just bust out. This is why we fap. Masculine energy just wants to just go nuts. You think of like a little like a little boy, like a little rambunctious boy just, you know, running all over the house going crazy, right? So I'll finish it there, guys. Let me just fix this lighting. So I'll finish it there, guys. I hope this made sense. I hope it was of help and resource. I would love to help you guys with finding these other passions, hobbies, endeavors, ways to enhance your health. That's the entire point of NoFap, guys. And um, that's really the whole point of this channel. It's not just a NoFap channel because NoFap in and of itself, just by itself, is almost frivolous. It's almost pointless. If it's not accompanied by, by other things, it's almost like bread. Like you never just eat bread for bread. You eat bread because you're gonna make a sandwich out of it. You put peanut butter or Nutella or jam, or you put meat and cheese. Like you don't, it's very, very rare. You can, you can eat bread. You you know, you can go to the store to just buy bread and just eat bread. Like you could, 
Is that what bread is meant for? Yeah, most cases, no. It's kind of like no fat. That's what's coming to mind. You use it to enhance and use other things together and then have the best goddamn sandwich in the entire world. So with that is that, guys. I'll finish it there. Freaking love metaphors and analogies. Um, thank you guys for watching. If you guys enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up, comment, subscribe. And as always, guys, you can check out the plugs. If you want to work with me at maybe finding what your passion is, turning that into a business, finding your creative endeavors, improving your health in other areas, then you can always apply for one-on-one -on -one coaching, guys. I'd love to help you guys out. Join the tribe. There's also the self-development course, guys, which speaks on just that, improving your health, your relationships, finding your passion, serving it to the world, guys. We speak of everything like this course. A lot of you guys have purchased and it's... I know it will change your life, point blank period. And finally guys, we have the middle ground, which is really where I think the majority of you guys should be putting your time and energy. That is the self-development workshop, all right guys, where I take 20 of you men, already guys, quite a few spots to fill up, but we still have some left and guys to uh, to really fill them up. Um, we're going live in about a week. I took off 20% on the original price. So if you guys have been uh, contemplating or thinking about it, I would definitely recommend it because it will sell out guys. And I really am excited to uh, to do this. The workshop guys consists of four one hour live stream calls with uh, unlimited group messaging in between. So it's just a community of us 20 guys. And we really focus on improving our health relationships, finding our passions and serving that to the world. So if you're interested guys, 20% off, I'd strongly recommend it. First come first serve. And I'll finish it there, guys. Thank you so much. I appreciate you guys. Love you. Accompany it. Make a goddamn sandwich. And it will be amazing. That's it, guys. Much love. Until next time. Peace.